I'm just about to pick up this new fan belt um, from my folks and Leela. I've been at parked opposite the lime kilns for a week now. It's a two day mooring, but uh, they very kindly spoke to CRT for me to explain that I am kind of a little bit broken down. Um, so I only have one belt, a fan belt on the boat, but I only use that when I need power each day. Well, I never like to outstay my welcome. Um, so I do know it's time to go soon. Once I get this on, I'm wondering, is it worth putting it on this evening? But yeah, I'm going to pick up Leela and the fan belt and have a crack at it tonight. I think it would feel really good if I can get this done myself. I think it's a valuable skill that I should probably learn. I'll let you know when I get back. Okay. Two fan belts have arrived. Um, I'm actually feeling quite intimidated to do this now. I've got my toolkit. I just don't have much of a choice, so I'm going to give it a go. I don't think I want to. Yeah. So this got left behind for me. So fun it is. Oh. Got to loosen this, bring it down, and then I can take this off, loop it back over, and then I can put the others on in theory. Now I'm just loosening these. I'm not going to take them all the way off, I'm just going to loosen them. Do it that way. And now I'm going to use the same one for this one. Well it's going ever so well because I can't fucking move anything. You know what, my mum hates it when I swear on her. So I do apologise. Oh, I bet this must be fucking painful to watch. is tight. Oh, fuck. The screw is off. So the next stage is um, Lucy Goosey? Fucking hell, I'm having such a shit day. I think I've got cracked it now. I just imagined myself telling my dad that I wasn't strong enough and then I uh, felt a bit ashamed. Um, okay. So, right, I've loosened that. Does that mean I can just slide it down now? Like I said, my, my friends have spoken about all this that I'm, what I'm doing. In theory, I'm just scared that this nut is gonna fall. But I uh, am still not really get it. I still, I'm still just doing what they told me to do. Well, I'll let you know when this is off. Okay, that's like that. So I'm now just removing the old fan belts. Just give me a minute. I don't know how amused I am, 
because I can't get the belt off without removing the small, the smaller belt, the alternator belt. I'm like, I've got to do all that again to another little starter motor to get it off. And I'm just wondering, is there like a smart, magical way that I don't know to get this belt off? I feel like I'm missing something clever. Ugh. Times like these when I try and do stuff like this, I go in with like confidence I can do this and I can do that, but really I'm terrified because if I can't do something so simple as this, it doesn't say much for my future abilities. Um damn it. I have to take off this lower thing and, and loosen it to take off this drive belt, the small drive belt, so I can take off the bigger fan belt. Yeah. I'm so very grumpy now. Um, because the batteries are low, the water pump is frozen on, and uh, I can't charge up the boat yet. And who knows how long it will take me to put these uh, new fan belts on, which I can't get on. And um, I'm going to have no power in part batteries. But apart from that, no, it's all shit. Darlings, can you not see that I'm busy? I'm busy. I'm very, very busy. I'm sorry, darlings. Don't, no, no, no. Okay, I had a mini pity party. Lila was really not impressed. Um, I'm gonna get back in. First there was darkness, and then... You have Xavier to assist! Look at his bottom. So, Zav's just called me. He's come down from Scotland, not especially just for this, but he's just cut the old fan belt off just to get rid of that nuisance. And now, is the ratchet useless? No. Okay. So I'm taking it, that's one bolt there. That's an Allen key, is it? On the other side? Yeah, where's your Allen key that you undid that with? So. I managed to undo, loosen one thing. Yeah. We're just right. fitting on the fan belt, so Zav is showing me how to do this one. Yeah. And then so I'm going start to. On there, bring it round. That is not gonna. It, Ian said it was gonna be tight. He said it would be tight. Yeah, where's the bolt out of that, Liz? Um, it is here. Okay, cool. Just checking so you haven't lost it. I'll hold that up tall. You come around me. Oh, hello. Right. So, so you want to lift it over the bottom of that big wheel mm -hmm. first. So it rounds the bottom there. Oh, first. Okay. Yeah, down there. Where the grooves are here. Now on this, on this. Oh, sorry. Okay. Is that over? Yeah. Those yeah. Sides. So, yeah, that's all the way in there. And then and these then, need to go sorry. on these two wheels here. Oh. Which, it is yeah. a proper squeeze, isn't it? Yeah. And they can't go on just one at a time. It has you to be both. You can put one on at a time now. Yeah, but that one you've got there. Is so what you want to do is get a screwdriver. Would an Allen key work? It's not got enough leverage. Would a, a spanner work? Get it like that. Okay. And then if you apply pressure to these fins, that way, see? Oh, okay. It should. I'm not making it work, am I? Yeah, that's good. Oh, shit. Should get some self strength on it. Is that rude? Can you hold that one there? Yes. Got it. I just had one with the on and I took it oh off no, so that I could show you how to do I it. Know. I'm sorry, man. It's all right. Okay. Then we'll go around a big wheel, flywheel. The flywheel. Oh. Superfly. Oh. 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 Oh
to see my heavy nets right now, darling. Uh, that feels tougher because it's more of a surface. Um, this one? Ready? No. Is that one? Yes! Yeah, okay, we'll do the same again. Yeah, we're spinning the big wheel. It's, it's Keep just that off your side. Off. And slap. Work it round as far as you can. Oh my god! So it goes on the alternator first and then on the flywheel. Your flywheel's covered in oil though. I don't know if that's going to cause an issue with squealing and slipping. Quite tight. Dra really. Well, we'll put tension, we'll put loads of tension on them anyway. Um, Can you see now how I feel like I'm in the confirmed gully? Oh, it's now it's not the top, oh, it's Megan. Hello. One more. We're just putting everything back together now. Say we, Zav. Oh no, mate! I'm absolutely covered in cuts as well. It's horrible, especially in mixes in, with oil. But Zav, if you haven't seen him before, he's on my other videos. He's on Oakwood um, at the Lovely Life on Instagram. I'll oh, put a little the thing right here. Yeah. And I'll let you know when it's all done. Right. Okay, so we've got... We've got the belts on. We need to put the starter on. motor back on and tension the belts off of both, on both alternators. So if I switch with you, mm -hmm. and then you can watch, and I'll show you how the starter motor attaches. And put my things back together, mate. Oh. oh. Okay, we're going to start her up now. We're packing away. I'm gonna just, I just wanna test her and then pack away if it's fine. Alright, well, all your tools that I've touched are on that shelf there anyway. Do it for mummy. supposed to run your engine over eight and I uh, hadn't eaten all day so I was just like oh, screw it went to the pub and um, bought Zav some dinner say thank you got back in the power for a shower so I'm covered in oil I'm in bed I've got no power to get any water out the sink so uh, I'm hoping tomorrow some miracle would have happened and I've got Oh, I don't I don't really know how to troubleshoot this. Everything that I would have used to troubleshoot this hasn't worked. Belts are up as tight as they can be. That is, you know, necessary, so I just I don't know. Is there something to the alternate belt, the smaller belt? Very tired. But it's not a bad thing. It's just another adventure. And I'm learning. Time to get some rest. Night night.